we will discuss about the moments in this video and first of all i want to tell you about the definition of moments what are moments what are moments moments are the statistical tools by means of which we can calculate the various statistical constants such as means variance skewness kurtosis of a given frequency distribution there are two types of moments one is row moments and second is central moment first we will discuss about row moments row moments are the moments those are calculated about any arbitrary point a here point a may be any positive or negative real number and the rth row moments about point a is denoted by mu r dash and its value is given mu r dash is equal to 1 by n summation f x minus a whole power r by putting r is equal to 0 1 2 3 and 4 we can get 0th first second third and fourth row moment about point a here we will discuss only about first row moment about point a and it will obtained by putting r is equal to 1 in this formula so first moment about point a that will be denoted by mu 1 dash and its value will be equal to 1 by n into summation f x minus a power 1 and it will be equal to mu 1 dash is equal to 1 by n summation f x minus 1 by n a into summation f in case of frequency distribution summation f is denoted by capital n so these will be cancelled out and 1 by n into summation f x this is equal to the mean of the given frequency distribution if we denote the mean by x bar then first row moments about arbitrary point a will become mu 1 dash is equal to x bar minus a here a is any arbitrary point if a we take a is equal to 1 then we will get first row moment about point 1 and its value will be equal to mu 1 dash is equal to x bar minus 1 if we take the point a is equal to 2 then we will get first moment about the point 2 and its value will be given by mu 1 dash is equal to x bar minus 2 we denote it again mu 1 dash now if we take the point a is equal to 0 then what we will get we will get the first moment about the point 0 and its value will be equal to mu 1 dash is equal to x bar so this was the first moment about any arbitrary point a and mean of the distribution is always equal to first moment about point 0 now we will discuss about the central moment central moments are the moments those are calculated about the mean of the distribution and the rh central moment is denoted by mu r and its value is given by 1 by n summation f x minus x bar whole power r by putting r is equal to 1 2 3 and 4 we will get first second third and fourth central moment so if we will put r is equal to 1 then we will get mu 1 that is first central moment and its value will be equal to mu 1 is equal to 1 by n summation f x minus x bar power 1 opening the summation we will get 1 by n summation f x minus x bar 1 by n summation f summation f x upon n this is equal to x bar and summation f is equal to n so it will become x bar minus x bar that is equal to 0 so the first central moment is always equal to 0 now if we will put r is equal to 2 then we will get the second central moment and it is equal to mu 2 is equal to 1 by n summation f x minus x bar whole square 
and we know that this is the formula of standard deviation square for a given frequency distribution so mu2 is equal to standard deviation square and we know that the standard deviation square is equal to variance of the frequency distribution so mu2 is equal to variance of the given distribution